First of all, you gotta pick the right handle. I got those at Lhosa online. You can find them pretty easily, pre-made. So this one is gonna go like that. You see how it's similar? Even though it's not perfect fit, we're gonna make it work. So simply put the ax and just stamp it down and let the seven pounds do its magic. Make sure you hit it on something soft so you don't split the bottom of the handle. But it's doing it all the way in till you're happy. That looks pretty good. It's very heavy so it's quite easy actually. Usually it comes with a couple wedges like that when you buy a handle. Make sure it comes with it. Man, that axle already looking so much better. And then looks like there's some kind of glue inside there. Also they pre-screw a hole for maybe a screw or something. So just like that. And it looks like it's just a perfect size handle for this axe. Check this out. It's gonna open up quite a bit. Right in the middle. Get yourself a nice... I would get like a rubber axe, but I couldn't find it. So just keep on going. Don't wanna crack anything. Don't have to do it all at once. So just take your time doing that. That would crack a little bit, but we wanna go all the way in. You can cut off the extras, whatever. But I wanna go as deep as possible because the tighter it will be, the better it will sit in there and it's not gonna come out. So I'm just gonna jam it in there. Wow, it's opened quite a bit. I don't know if it's too much, but we could have cut off the extras. So I don't know, it looks kind of okay. Kind of opened up quite a bit, but this hole is really vintage. It's a little bit different. To make sure this doesn't come off, I'm gonna nail in this thing as well. You can put a screw in there as well, looks like. So that way, it's gonna go in there and be there for a long time. And I'll have to worry about this handle come off ever. Probably put the feet on the bottom so it doesn't jump. The same thing, I don't wanna mess up this little metal thing. As, as you can see now, it sits there even better. I mean, I'm happy with that. As you can see, you can handle the axe very easy by yourself at Lowe's or Home Depot tool store. One of these things, ready to go. Looks like I got pulled this out. I think it was like a price tag or something. So beautiful handle. Let's go put it to the test. This is actually, axe looks a lot better than I thought now.